YouTube, what it do, do. It is your boy, Acapella Bully. So remember, turn up the volume so you can understand me fully. Real quick, before we get into the view, let's get a moment of silence. A second moment of silence for my boy, Kobe. Thank you. Appreciate you. Today, we got another one of them great, beautiful unboxings. Super duper OG right here. A classic in the game. This is 11 and a half grown man feet. You dig me? And you see it say Air Force One Sheed Low. You dig? Price on these? At one point, <laughs> at one point in time, they was 91, 97. But no, these ran me 150 off of Stock X app. Let's get into them. Get the paperwork out the way from Stock X. This paper even is OG, and you got the Air Force One low, all patent leather, all patent leather. I say all patent leather. Thanks, man. Air Force One Low. You see the tag still on there from Stock X, man. These things are beautiful. You see them shining in the light. I know you see them glistening. Size 11 and a half. Grown man feet. You got white, blue, red on the back with that Nike Air on them cheeks. All blue bottom like you done stepped on a pile of Smurfs. Skeeted up the front. With some of that blue Jew, <laughs> blue Jew, goo Jew juice. You got the red Nike Air, Air Force One on the tag of the tongue. Says so a Air Force. And then one Nike Air with the check, man. Beautiful, beautiful sneaker. Great sneaker. I could see me rocking this for show for show. Uh, this coming 4th of July. Trying to see about the uh the date this was made. There we go. Date it was made January twentieth, two thousand six, y'all. Super OG. I don't know if y'all can see it. Yeah, right there, right there, under the uh, what what place is that? Under the Euro and the CM um date. I mean, number says January 20th, 2006, man. Super OGs right here. That boy, She, Man, collaboration with, with Nike. You see She right there on the back. Shooting the ball up, man. Beautiful sneaker. And if you know anything about She, you would know that he definitely played for the Detroit Pistons. Which is where you get the colorway from. And all his collaborations he does with uh, with Nike. Majority of his shoes are all in patent leather. You got the Air Force One Low. I think he got the Air Force One Highs. And then I even think he got some Air Force One Mids out there. But he mostly deal with the Air Force Ones. That's his favorite shoes. So, from Nike anyway. So, uh, yeah, why not? I like them. Super easy to clean. Don't have to worry about spraying anything on these to keep them nice and smooth. You know what I'm saying? Nice and clean. They kind of clean themselves. They're already water resistant. Only part I would say you have to worry about is like scuffs, creasing, which you might want to get like some crease uh, resistant inserts in these or something like that. But uh, these are dead stock as you can see the bottom of them. I don't know what this white look paint thing here is i don't know if that's something from the factory or something they did i don't know but overall they haven't been worn at all got these from stock x for a beautiful price of 150 which i ain't mad for a sneaker that came out in 2006 you know what i'm saying super duper ogs there's no yellowing on these the patent leather stood up to the test of time these over what 10 years old until 16 17 18 19 20 you're looking at a 14 year old shoe here y'all 14 year old shoe. So anybody born in 2006 to right now is 14 years old right now. You know what I mean? Or gonna be 14 years old this uh this year. 
I love the red patent leather on the back with the Nike Air. It's beautiful, super duper classic. The white patent leather all right here. The, now the Nike check, this is straight leather. This ain't padded. But uh, the front of the toe box, all this from right here, all the way up to here, and then right here is all blue patent leather. The laces, you see blue, still dead stock lace. I'm guessing, I suppose they did stock lace like that. The box even, for if you like the box, box heads, it's still OG, man. Um, nothing special with it. Just inside, just the paper and whatnot. And, you know, StockX put their sticker in there. But uh, overall, man, it's a beautiful sneaker. Me being a lover of Air Force One Lows, I had to have these. And they reminded me of the, um, as far as the patent leather go, just those Air Force One uh, gold toes that I had did a review on last year. Y'all can go watch that video, too, and support that, like it, and share it and whatnot. Um, for the review sake of it that I did on those. And then I just like patent leather on shoes, man, besides the uh, just the Jordan 11s, you know what I'm saying? Um, any sneaker that, you know, as long as color coordinated right and look good and it makes sense, any shoe that really has patent leather on it, I'm a fan of it. You know what I'm saying? I don't really go against the patent leather look. I like it. I appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? When Nike does it or um, Jordan Brand does it or even if uh, Adidas tries to do something like that, uh, I like it when um, Reebok just put it on those uh, heat over hypes, the, the toe box of the heat over hype uh, Reebok questions. I like how they did it on them so actually i did it on the front and the back of those but uh overall man this is a beautiful sneaker summer is coming spring is right around the corner so yes yeah, sir these will be getting rocked all over the place <laughs> you feel me because not too many people got shoes like this from 2006 in this great condition you know what i'm saying still dead stock oh this one doesn't have an in shoe insert and it's getting to the uh inside as well um, the inside is red, and you see it got she shooting the ball. Yes, sir. She shooting the ball. The inside is all red. When you step on it, well, when you stepping in them, you know what I'm saying? See what she still in there? Wait. There you go. There you go. Um, still, you know, still in there. Um, OG shoe insert. Bang, bang. From 06. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Inside still good on these. Beautiful sneaker, man. And shout out to whoever sold these to me through StockX, man. Whoever sold them on StockX, thank you very much. Because me, I wouldn't be able to sell these. <laughs> They're just too beautiful, man. Again, that's a uh, 11 and a half right there. Of course, you did. Grown man foots. And uh, we in the game, baby. We in the game. You know what I'm saying? I like the hint with the blue air right here. You know what I'm saying? White around that that line to go around. You know, all Air Force Ones. I like the blue the blue patent leather right here in the middle. And then the white shake bead off of that running into the the back of the uh the back of the heel into the red patent leather. That's dope. They put she blue on the outside, it's like embroidered. I like that. That ain't never coming off. That stitching right there. That's beautiful, baby. Well, she on there. Detroit Piston player. You know what I'm saying? He retired now, and of course, you know, living his best life. But it's good to see he's still uh, doing his thing and still uh, able to, you know, collab with Nike and stuff and come out with some beautiful, beautiful one of a kind sneakers, man. That. Sneaker heads like me and you and sneaker enthusiasts and connoisseurs can appreciate, man, at the end of the day, point blank period, because that's what it's all about, man. Copping what you like and what you like, show it, man. Let the people know it, man. You dig? Acapella bully style. So y'all go ahead and remember, man, hit that like button. Subscribe to me, man. My goal this year is to hit a 1,000 subs. Lord willing, with y'all help, because I'll be getting down, like, a good, decent amount of views. But don't nobody want to subscribe, man. Y'all like watching, but y'all be wanting to subscribe, man. What's up with that? How y'all going to come to the show and don't want to buy nothing at the door? You know what I'm saying? 
I don't want to live in the hood, but I want to help keep it clean. Get it. Y'all just want to come through, mess stuff up, and leave, though. <laughs> you dig me? I ain't mad at y'all, though, man. Do what y'all do. You dig? But uh, thank you for watching, man. Thank you for rocking with your boy. These are on StockX, man, so you can go try to find your size if you can. Remember, they came from 2006, so it ain't that many left. You know what I mean? It ain't that many people letting these go on an everyday basis. Um, let me see. What's up? What was they? Oh, the color of these is uh, Blue Jay, White, Varsity Red, Blega. I am guess I say Blega. Bla and RP. R-O, so repro. <laughs> All these see still got the OG uh, www.nike.com on there. So, yeah, man, 11 and a half, the size, grown man feet. This sticker is over the original uh, price on there. So I don't know what, what price it was originally way back in the day. Ain't no telling. But that's it, man. That's the shoes in a nutshell. The Rasheed Wallace Lowe's Detroit Piston colorway, man, for the team we play for. And we on, man. I love how they got that Air Force One spelled out on there, though, with that Nike Air check, man. That's beautiful. Nike Air on the back for my hype beast lovers. <laughs> Rasheed Wallace still doing his thing, still putting up buckets, shooting heavy. And the inside, man, all red with the blue Rasheed. And the inside as well. You see it. You saw it. I know you saw it. We saw it together, baby. So remember, man, it's your boy, Acapella Bully. So turn up the volume so you can understand me fully. Thank you. Subscribe, like, share, watch it with your friends over and over again. I'm gone, man. One love.